Hi guys, welcome to Man United Gang, United's number one fan channel. Now, in this video, I want to talk about a story that is coming from different sources about Manchester United identifying a new midfield target. But before I do that, please remember to hit that subscribe button. Also, don't forget to comment, like, and share the video. And most of all, turn on the notification bell so that if any content comes out, you are the first person to watch. But uh, let us go back to this story that uh, is coming out from different uh, media sources. So Manchester United apparently have identified the toughest midfielder known as Mauro Arambari. So Mauro Arambari is a Uruguay international and he's 25 years old and currently he's playing for Getafe in La Liga. So this player is very sensational and Manchester United have looked at him and they are considering to make a bid for him. So what has triggered this move? Remember Manchester United as a football club were looking at uh, Declan Rice. But Declan Rice is likely to cause a huge sum of amount. But uh, this Mauro Arambari has only a 21.5 million pounds release clause. And if Manchester United can trigger that release clause, then they are likely to get this player. So this player is 25 years old and then uh, he is a Uruguayan, so that means that uh, Manchester United can get this deal. And why am I saying so? Remember, Cavani is also a Uruguayan, and this can make this player to come to Old Trafford. Remember, at Getafe, currently as I'm speaking, he's being paid £14,000 a week, but Manchester United could bring the player at the club and offer him let's say even something like 90,000 pounds per week and I know the player will make a move. So before I look at how this player is good, uh, please remember to hit that uh, like button on the video and also remember to subscribe to the channel. So back to Mauro Arambari. So Mauro Arambari, this season alone he has scored uh, three goals and remember this is a player that is playing in the central midfield position But uh, he can as well uh, Play in a more attacking role. Uh, he can play in as an attacking Midfielder so you see that uh, he's very flexible and is not only a number six So this story is very interesting because there are speculations that uh, Paul Pogba might leave the club uh, the club and also the Mandematis future is not known because apparently Jose Mourinho is looking to sign the Mandematis. Then Juan Mata's future is also not known. So you can see that uh, these are three midfielders currently at Manchester United whose future is not known. And if Juan Mata or Mandematis can leave the club, then that means there will be a room in that midfield for another player to come in. And that's why I think Manchester United are looking to sign uh, Mauro Arambari. So how does Mauro Arambari play? Mauro Arambari have said that uh, he has scored three goals for Getafe this season. But apparently he is the, most, uh, is the second most booked player in La Liga. He has received 11 yellow cards. What does this tell you? This tells you that uh, this is a very aggressive and energetic player. He's not afraid to make any tackles. And that's why you can see the number of yellow cards he has received this season. Then, uh, that is one of the negative side of him. But you can see that uh, he also has some positives. So one of the positives is that um, he has won 74 free kicks for his club this season. I think that is crazy. He has won 74 free kicks 
for his club this season. That is crazy, I can tell you. That means that this player is the most fouled player in La Liga, if I'm not wrong. 74 free kicks. That number is crazy. And again, this season, he has made 57 tackles. He has won 57 tackles and also made 52 interceptions. So you can see that uh, this is a player who is very, very good and very active on the pitch. So if Manchester United can go and sign Mauro Arambari, according to me, I think he can be a good addition to Manchester United. But of course, this is a developing story that I will be following keenly and then I will be alerting you guys on how it is going. But I think Mauro Arambari fits the profile uh, for Manchester United because we were talking of Declan Rice and you know Declan Rice in order for Manchester United to buy Declan Rice from West Ham they have to pay 80 million pounds for that player but Mauro Andambari who can play as a central midfielder and also as an attacking midfielder can only cost Manchester United 21.5 million pounds so you can see that this is a deal that can be done and you will see what Manchester United will do about this. But I think according to the statistics that I have uh, told you right now, you can see that uh, Mauro Arambari can be a good player for Manchester United. So let me know about what you think with this story. Do you think Manchester United will go ahead and sign Mauro Arambari? But to me, I think this deal can happen if Nemanja Matic, Juan Mata and Paul Pogba will leave the club. Or if not the three, either Nemanja Matic or Juan Mata will leave the club, then this deal is likely to happen. But according to how I've seen Mauro Arambari and the statistics, I think he will bring something to Manchester United. So that's all about Mauro Arambari. I hope you have enjoyed and gotten something from the video. And uh, I want to thank you for watching. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also turn on the notification bell. Like, comment and also share the video. But for now, I want to say bye bye.